when we feel like we aren't in direction of, of our actions. Uh, it does make us feel helpless. It makes us feel vulnerable. It makes us feel weak, which I think are more things that we fear rather than change itself. Yeah. And if you're not present and you don't feel that internal power, that empowered, right? Mm. Then as these transitions happen in your life, you don't have that clear direction over where you're going to point the ship that is your life, right? We feel as though I don't have, I don't have the helm. So how can I direct my own ship? But if we do take the time to stay present and understand what's, what's happening, not what we think will happen, it's great to have contingency plans, right? To If you feel into the future and you feel like, wait a second, there are all of these different potentials that could unfold. And I desire to be prepared for all of them. So if it happens, I know where I'm going to direct myself. That's a beautiful thing to do. But don't stay there. And don't hang out in the fear of the worst outcome. Mm. Because then you're pulling that one toward you, mm -hmm. right? That's the experience you feel you're going to have. It's the experience you have even if something different happens. You've spent so much time focused on that buoy out in front of you that that's where you've directed your life ship. And so if we get the chance to say, okay, I have it covered now. I have all of these plans that I feel like when it presents itself, I at least have an idea of the direction I'd go regardless. Then you come back to the present moment and you understand the experience that is happening. Otherwise, you're not going to be able to point yourself in the accurate direction. I like that. Yeah, that's important to, to highlight that what we put our focus on, that's the reality that we experience. And so maybe that can help us relieve that, ourselves of that fear and that stress. Because oftentimes we'll say, oh, well, I don't want this to happen, but I keep putting my focus on it and then it happens you're like oh there now now life is happening to me and against me instead of with me and for me yeah and so uh, that can help us get a little bit more as you're saying empowerment of, of our actions and our choices to create our future experiences but every future moment that we have is experienced in the present and so the more awareness and conscious choice we can place into the present moment based on what we desire to experience in the future, that can really help us navigate our transitions with a lot more purpose, yeah. intention, and in many ways, elegance. Yeah. <laughs> because it's, it's, it's saying, okay, well, I, this is what I desire. I know this in my heart. I know this in my head. And this action that I take is going to uh, fulfill me now and in the future. Yeah. It's hard to be fearful when that happens. Yeah.